Hi there and welcome back to another week of Two Steve's Review. Uh, this is Steve 1. This is Steve 2 and this week we are reviewing Jumanji. Right, okay, let's just get straight on to it. Steve, cast. Right, our first person is Robbie Williams. Uh, well, Robin Williams, you know what I mean? It's just like, hey, a little bit here, here's a bottle, like, hey, here's a you know, bottle on top of the head, yeah, 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 yeah. Right, that's okay, that's just Robin Williams. Uh, he is a well known stand up comedian. And also, he's done a certain set of great films, especially with this era at the time. Well, we've got Good Will Hunting. Awesome. We've got Mrs. Doubtfire. Do, 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 do like a lady. And then awesome. we've got Good Morning Vietnam. Fucking awesome. So, yeah, that's all good. Who have we got next, Steve? Then we've got the young Kirsten Dunst. Well, okay, uh, at this point, she is quite a decorated young actress as a child actress. She's like, had seven movies before, so yeah, she's in a wheelhouse at the moment. But she's most well known for those god awful Spider Man films. Here we go again. Right, okay, yeah, right. They're just awful, Steve. You've got to do it right. He's Spider Man. Don't even go there, just get on with the plot, mate. Okay, yeah. uh, plot we've got is, uh, it's 1969, two little, like, a little boy finds a board game, like, being bullied a little bit, wants to run away, and uh, after that, like, um, his best friend comes round, and uh, they decide to play a board game, and uh, things take a little bit of a turn for the worst, and he gets sucked into the board game, Ouch. and then uh, 26 years later, when it's yeah. 1995, yeah, yeah. Fuck me. That was a good year. Yeah. Yeah, but True. anyway, yeah, right. As back we were to, saying. Back, back to the storyline. Yeah, as we were saying, like, um, it comes down to 1995, two other kids find the game and decide that they're going to play this game. And yeah. uh, they roll the dice, and yeah. uh, magically pops out Robin Williams. And uh, all hijinks ensues from there. Well, we've got evil monkeys. We've got a lion, yeah. we've got monsoons, we've got um, all sorts of things. We've got stampedes. We've, we, they're, they're like, you know what I mean, like spiders, you know what yeah. I mean, like vine plants that grab you. You've, you've got everything. Everything that should be in the Everything, everything right. fucks up. Right, okay. Especially a fucking cop car. Yep. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. No, no, no. Like, uh, this is the uh, era of token black guy, um, unfortunately, again. Yeah, black guy always gets it. Yep, and uh, this time round, like, he's shot on from the Empire State Building. Yeah. Yeah, pretty bad, pretty his, bad. His police car gets fucked up, and it still works. Hmm, yeah. Hollywood physics. Yeah. Gotta love him. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, gotta go wrong. So, what is your favourite bit of the film, Steve? Well, my favourite bit of the film is when... The hunter gets released, ah. and he's called Van Pelt. Van Pelt, and he's after Robin Williams. Ah, he's yes. To hunt him down. What was that famous line he says? Oh, blast! 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 Oh, yes, indeed, indeed. So, what, what's your favourite scene then? My favourite scenes have to be uh, generally the monkeys, my fellow brethren. You know, what I mean, peace. You know, I love my monkeys. Um, especially in this because all they're doing is just like nicking stuff and uh, just being cheeky little bastards to be honest with you and they fought the law and the law lost yes they, they did lose uh, they lost big style big style yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah so that's good so uh, what's the final thoughts well my final thoughts is I, I do quite like it because it's there it's comic yeah it's a kids film and my rating I give it an eight and a half out of ten. I'm giving it an eight and a half out of yeah. ten. You keep on staying on that number every week. Stay. Come on, come on, digress. <laughs> to give it, give it either an eight or a nine. All right then, I'll give it a nine. Yes. Right. Okay. That's good. Right. What I'm going to say with this one was basically I was going into this. And I have a feeling like right. I'm not going to enjoy this. I'm not going to enjoy this. This is going to bring up some bad childhood memories, but unfortunately, I actually really enjoyed it. For once. For once, yeah. It, yeah. it was quite strange, you know. This time he's not slating it off. Well, no, no. No, Steve. I'll, I'll, I'll get some slating later on, but not today. That's alright then. My childhood has prevailed. That's fair enough. Right, okay. So, uh, 
basically what I'm going to say is it's an 8 out of 10 but also the only thing that seems very dated to me is like sort of like the CGI and the animatronics yeah but you've got to think it's 1995 for god's sake 90, come on 95 okay yeah. okay yeah I'm 95 good. was a good year but you've got to think of the technology wise in 1995 till now okay I'll let go of the CGI yeah right but those animatronics and those spiders were awful I'm shit scared of spiders and those things didn't even fucking scare me you know what I mean this is a guy that refuses to watch eight legged freaks you know okay. what I mean because I'm not fucking scared. I've, I've got people that don't like spiders, but they'll watch it like it freaks. No, nah, no, nah, not for me. Not for me. Right, okay, yeah, so uh, we're, uh, we'll sign off with that one, to be honest with you. This is uh, Steve 1. This is Steve 2, and hopefully to see you next week. Man, it is way too hot in here. Here you go. Oh, you kinky buzz. Oh, you dirty twat.